Hello, welcome to Spotlight on Source. My name is Laura Higgs. Today is October 19th, 2023. And I'm privileged to have with me here in our interview chair, Elizabeth Kancaid, who is here to speak to us about uh, the Source Imagination Library. Welcome, Elizabeth. Thank you. Better known as Buffy, I think yeah, that's, that's right. your, yeah. your um, name that you go by mostly, right? Either way. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so I want to know about the Source Imagination Library. Um, is this new here? Uh, it's, we actually established it in March of 2022. We became okay. a partner with the Dolly Parton Foundation of Canada. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. So what is it about? Well, it's an awesome program. Um, it's a book gifting program for children under five. So right from birth to age five, you can register for our program and receive a free book in the mail every month addressed to your child. So it's very exciting oh, for the nice. kids. Yeah. And we're trying to have every child under five in Surus and the surrounding area registered to receive free books through our program. Okay. So how much does it cost? Well, it's free for registered families. Okay. It's absolutely free. Okay. Um, we do all the fundraising for our community, ah. and we work with the Dolly Parton Foundation to cover the costs and the operations. So it's fairly inexpensive on the back end, actually. It's only about $4 per book per month per child, which is a lot okay. cheaper than the bookstore. Um, and over a year, it's forty six twenty, um, and that's twelve books. That's a whole annual library for a child for only twenty wow. forty six twenty. Yeah, yeah, that's that's uh, incredible. Mm -hmm. um, when you said it was started back in two thousand twenty two, mm -hmm. and did somebody just come up with this idea? Did you read about it online? How did you figure that out? Yeah, well, one of the founding coordinators, Chantelle Peters, she's an early childhood educator. Okay, she brought the idea to me and said, "Have you heard about this Dolly Parton Library?" Um, it's a free book gifting program. You can sign up your community. So we just thought we'd look into it. Um, and it was really easy to sign up Surus as an affiliate community and partner with that, ah. with the larger, it's a global organization. They actually okay. mail books all over the world. Okay. Mm -hmm. How can someone donate to the program then? Yeah, it's really easy to donate, um, especially online. They can go to imaginationlibrary.com. There's a donate button and you just find Surus. So your donation goes to Surus and stays in our community program. Wow. 100% um, of the donation. Great. So right on the website, we also can take um, personal donations or larger donations by check and we can do that and everyone can have a charitable donation receipt if they so need. Oh, great. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's perfect then. Um, does the program mail out uh, one book per household? Uh, it's one book per child. So if ah. you have two kids under five, the books are actually ranged from zero to one, one to two, two to three, right. three to four. So if you have siblings in a household who are under five, they can both be in the program and they'll get unique books mailed to For them. For their age group? Yeah. Okay. Wow, that's mm -hmm. great. So how, do, how does a, a parent or a caregiver sign their child up? Mm. It's very easy. Again, you can do it right online if you go to imaginationlibrary.com. The registration program is a process is mm -hmm. very easy to do there and it's quite clear what you need to do and we can also help the coordinators of the program, myself and Amy Lees, mm -hmm. can help sign families up paper-wise or help them work, get through online. Okay, that's great. Okay, what are the benefits of the Surus Imagination Library? Well, it is awesome. Mm -hmm. um, the idea is to promote a love of reading in young children and to help um, stimulate early literacy. And it's this like key part of the life where literacy can really set kids up for future success. So if you can get reading happening at home at an early age, um, we'll have more kindergarten readiness and more children going to kindergarten kind of on a level playing field. Mm -hmm. um, other benefits, of course, are the bonding that happens when you're reading at home. And because the book is coming in the mail to the family, um, the child is going to ask, can we read this book? You know, can we read my new book? So there's more interaction between the caregiver and the child. And research has shown it actually increases that interaction by 38% just by having a new book come in the mail every month. Mm. Um, it's also a great way to welcome new people to Surus. Um, if a new family moves to Surus uh, and they have kids under five, they can basically sign up to have a free library. Mm -hmm. So it's wonderful that way. There are lots of benefits across the board. Well, do you know what I like about that idea is that when you take the children to the library and, and borrow books, mm -hmm. they all have to go back. 
Yeah. And that's still great. I mean, they can yes, do that. Absolutely. absolutely do that. But this way they get it and it goes into their own library at home. Yeah, they're building, we're building yeah. home libraries that stay, these books stay in the community. So all the yeah. books that have come in since we started in 2022, they stay here, they get traded among families. They And passed on to yeah. the next generation and so on. Yeah, so it's a wonderful investment. Yeah, absolutely. So... How many books are sent out worldwide, we're talking, due to the Dolly Parton Imagination Library? Yeah, Dolly Parton is a powerhouse. Yeah, yeah, they she have is, for out, sure. They have mailed out 218 million books wow. across the globe so far since she started it in 1995. Okay, so Dolly Parton is a, is a wonderful lady, and she does lots mm -hmm. of... Um, of um, philanthropy she's very good at that and she just loves people you can tell that when yes. you watch her on uh, so she gives a lot of this away but do you guys raise some money to help with administration costs is that what that we do we raise the cost of the book so that 4620 that I mentioned for the library that is our cost of okay. being in the program uh, so that's per child per right. year um, so we do our own fundraising locally um, but they carry the, there's obviously a larger cost Absolutely. that they meet in the middle and they do all the operations, really, yeah. mailing out the book and everything. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. another thing about Dolly Parton, because of this program, because our library is affiliated with her foundation, um, we have, the children can get a birthday message video from Dolly Parton. There oh, are really? videos on YouTube of her reading the books. So you can actually have Dolly Parton read the book oh. that they may have gotten in the mail. It's just really a sweet program. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's made me appreciate absolutely. Dolly Parton so yeah. much more. <laughs> yeah, she is. She's, she's amazing. amazing. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Okay, so how many books have been brought into our local community because of this program? Uh, already over 1,300. Really? Yeah, it will be close to 1,400 probably November 1st, just in a little over a year. So people sign up, and you, as administration, you guys get uh, word that they've signed up for this, and mm -hmm. you guys are the administrators of that. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So we approve the registrations mm -hmm. to make sure that people are in the right mailing area. Our coverage area is by postal code, so that's generally how we mm -hmm. make sure that people are in the few postal codes that we cover. Um, we can also individually sign up someone who maybe has a different postal code but uses service as a hub or whose children will be going to service school. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, that's handy to know. Mm -hmm. Okay, why is this such an important program? I mean, we already know, but can you tell me more about that? Yeah, I think, um, you know, the three of us who are the coordinators now, we are people who love to read, and that's been such a rich part of my life. And I know the others, like Amy and Chantelle, are readers as well. And it's just really important for kids to have that opportunity, regardless of, you know, their what might be happening in their life. So we want all kids to have beautiful home libraries of great books. They're Canadian content books. They often have, if it's not the author, it's the illustrator. They're diverse. They represent a lot of different types of Canadians. Um, so they're getting exposure through the books that are coming in of different parts of Canada and just developing that love of reading and early literacy, which again will set them up for future success. And then those people they grow into community members, mm -hmm. and we have community members who have grown up in this program that's been so wonderfully right. supportive. So right. there are lots of benefits. There, yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Well, the kids are the future of any club, any community that they're involved in later on. It's good to set them up really well when they're young. Yeah, and it's so easy because it's free for the families, and that's all they have to do when it comes in the mail to them. It's like Christmas. All these yeah. books pour into the post office, yeah. and we get such nice feedback from the families. Their kids are so excited about the books they yeah. get. And I think it's yeah. great that they get something in the mail for themselves. I know. Who <laughs> I love good mail that's not bills? <laughs> yeah. Right? Yeah, no kidding. It's a book in the mail, and it's free for the families, and it's at such a low cost to us. If we just keep up a little bit of fundraising, we can do it. We'd love to register every child under five mm -hmm. in, in, our postal co in our coverage area. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Well, that's wonderful. That's wonderful. Thank you so much for coming in and sharing Thank that with us, Buffy. Me. It's a really extremely important uh, program that's new to Surus. Mm -hmm. So Surus people with kids under five and caregivers, grandparents, okay. whoever, sign the kids up online and you'll be taken care of. Thank you so much for coming in. Thanks for having me. Thank you for joining us here at Spotlight and Surus. Have a wonderful day.